my name is Patrick Flynn, and I play the role of Dan. Till you come home to me. There's something very tragic about Dan, and even though he's I put it to you like this. The way I looked at it is that at first I'm, I read Dan and like, you know, like I can see a lot of similarities, but at the same time, there's a lot of things I would, I just don't cross. You know what I mean? Dan crosses a whole bunch of things and like you can easily see them as like, like what were you thinking? Or like, why would you do that? Or like, why would you go over that line? You know what I mean? And on the other hand, it's just like this guy is doing it to, to survive, to live. You know what I mean? He's doing it because. He believes these are the best choices that he can make, you know what I mean? Even though we don't see it that way. I, I feel great. Um, I feel like, whether we know it or not, um, I feel like there's a great rapport and like a really like open sense of like, you know, be free with your actions, you know what I mean? Like where you go, how you interact with people, you know what I mean? And even we all know, signing up for this is that it's a very intimate show, you know what I mean? And it's very, very personal, you know what I mean? The, the way that I, like, I thought of it and we all spoke about it. It's like, this, this is like, these are the scenes that, that, go, that people go through that you never hear them talk about. Like, you'll never hear them say something like this. But it happens. Pretty intense, you know what I mean? Um, the, you know, hardworking production, you know, uh, there's a lot of work that you know, we have to do for ourselves. Uh, to make the you know the show what it is and make it live up to you know, the best the best that it can be. Mm, like metaphoric in a way because it's like in an effort to get closer with people, what ends up happening is we end up driving them further away from us. Mm -hmm. So it's I'd, I'd say it's yeah I'd say it's ironic. I guess. Till you come